So I had to make a quick target run. I decided to do the online ordering and pick up, which is a godsend because this target is crazy busy all the time. But oh my God, I'm just a mess. But it will be quick in and out and back home to everything else you have to do on your weekend. It's Saturday reset time. Not sure how these are going, but um, you know, I'm I'm trying to go 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 and keep things pumping along. So to start off this vlog, this is the nail check and the wear on haute couture. Not too bad. I mean, obviously it it wears down pretty pretty easily on um I am not I'm not precious I don't wear gloves when I'm you know in the kitchen so on and so on so a lot of wear a lot of typing a lot of just hand washing I'm just not a careful person so it's just kind of is what it is uh no top coat though again just two coats thin coats of this and that is what happened i am drinking my coffee i'm gonna pick out the new fragrances for the week i'm gonna pick out the bag for this week i'm going to say that i was not the biggest fan of my morgan um, yeah, so I gotta find something else to carry that will be just a better use of space. But, um, I guess my commentary on the Morgan is it's making me think, do I need a baguette? Because I don't know if it's the shape of the bag, the flap in the closure. There's a reason why I don't really care for the Chanel flap bags. And maybe that's just not my style. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I think maybe I'm a tote kind of person. Um, I don't know. Something about it just was way too fussy and a pain to carry. Um, my purse, uh, purse, my phone kept falling out of the back pocket where I wanted to keep it. So having to carry it on the inside, you know, it, it is what it is, but I was just kind of, I don't know, just a little, a little annoyed with it. And of course, um, I did have to switch between cars and I, I like having both sets of keys in my bag so I don't have to worry about it. So I know I have either one at any given moment and I kept like, oh, I forgot to throw the keys in the car. <laughs> so I have to come back at the house and get get the car keys, which is, I know, first world problems. But like, again, it, the convenience of having everything in your bag, small bags and I, I'm a, I'm a big bag girl and y'all know that so anyhow so we're going to change the nails find something else think of what the theme for this week was um yeah well we'll see how and what we decide on how we doing mama you going to give me less scares yeah we'll put we'll do less scares this week you're gonna promise you're not gonna promise you're just gonna look away well, at least you're eating a little bit. You're still snorting, but you're doing a little bit better. Leaving a mess all over your ottoman. Your comfy mountain. Yeah. Love you, mama. So as we know, we were carrying this little number. And I just got delivery from Coach Outlet. And I was like, what did I order? And I remembered that I had picked up a little number for my birthday, just a little doodad, and I wanted a catch-all, put it away, a catch-all for my um, bags for my pens. And this came up on their website. 
than I thought it would do the trick rather nicely for my larger bags. Probably not so much in here. It's a different shade of purple, but I thought it was pretty cute. It's pretty much exactly like the um, Louis Vuitton, what is it, Elizabeth pouch? I can't remember the, the name, but it was like 40 bucks and I thought it would be a cute little thing to, to have. So we will try that out. But as I mentioned, I was not the biggest fan this week of the Morgan. And as I mentioned, the phone is back here and it, every time in the car, it would, the bag would fall over and the, it's not going to do it now, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently. No, there it goes. I don't know. Maybe just the force of how I drive and I do drive like a maniac, so I'm not going to you know, sugarcoat that. Um, it would just like, it'd fall in the seat and then the phone would fly and it'd be, you know, going between the seats and craziness. So wasn't the biggest fan of keeping the phone back there. And then all I could really carry in here comfortably was, um, my wallet and the one car key. Um, I did have at some point the pens and the coin in here, but I had to go into the office one day. So I had like my key card in here and, um, I forget what else was in here, just something else I needed for, for work or just a meeting. So I didn't have to carry my entire computer or anything like that, but just, you know, some stuff to go in for a quick meeting. And I just, just was kind of annoyed with it. So I'm going to put this one away and figure out what I want to wear. And then I noticed that I heavily, besides that damage right there that I did, um, somehow in hanging this up last year, it's heavily warped. It like has stayed in this kind of bent boomerang shape. So I'm going to try rolling it like that within the crossbody and see if keeping it this way for a amount of time within the bag will um, help with that. Um, this did not come with a dust bag. I don't, my remembering wrong possibly, but there used to be at least little cheap dust bags that outlet used to give us way back in the day. And I, I will admit, I have not bought anything at the outlet for years. So bags, at least. I bought jewelry, I bought shoes, I bought, um, you know, SLGs, everything else under the sun. No, I haven't bought a bag in a long time from the outlet. So um, when I got this one, and granted, I did buy it through um, outlet.com, and it came with no dust bag. But I could have sworn that when my friend, I went shopping with her about a year, year and a half ago, I could have sworn that her bag came with a dust bag. So I'm kind of confused that it didn't. So if you get them, I'm curious. So I'm going to find a fashion file, real real, something like that, dust bag, and figure out where to store this one. Um, put that right there for now. So let's figure out what makes sense. Cause I need to carry this stuff. I think I'd rather, thank you Dee, Dee for, for this present, but I think I want this larger one for now. Tremonts off, so nice little leather tabs right here. We'll put the pens in there. 
and I'll probably put my um, whatever else I might want to store in there in there as well. So let's let's find a bag. Okay, I am choosing the giant the GM no A as the bag of the week. And of course, to deform, I had crap in there. So I had this giant, giant, this Christian Dior pillow was in it. And I have no idea why, honestly, it, I, I, base shaper, I don't know what I was doing with it, but this is like from the Privé collection perfumes. I have no idea. And a mask from the pandemic was still in there and some napkins. So whatever the heck caused that to happen those were in there <laughs> so anyway um so we're going to have all of this stuff and since i can have a catch-all with some items this time i may go up to a larger um wallet this time we'll see but i'm thinking more the yeah. what I planned to use last week was from my bucket bag this little catch-all with all of these in there so that one this my phone coins I know I had there they are some more pens and items I need to go in here. Have my other car keys. So in a perfect world, I would have, and I do, it's in my other no way. That's way the hell up there. Um, I have a organizer that fits inside here, this, this shape really well and I would normally pull that out and use it but I think I'm just going to be casual and throw everything in here and have more room than I need. The only problem is I'm gonna show you is literally it's it's just a ball of everything in there so that's not wise let's let's rethink that so that one for sure that one can be down there let's rethink let's rethink that down there how about we do I want to carry Felici? I don't want a purse instead of purse. I put this in here. We can throw keys in there, coin in there. Down the bottom there, so it's still and feel. I almost want to grab the smaller Noe because it'd be so much more organized, but I think I'm okay with that. So there's the black hole, and that way, when I go shopping or out with my friend or whatever, um, I can throw stuff in here and not have to worry about not having stuff so yeah we're just gonna do it everything in the kitchen sink kind of thing do you hear dolly snoring over there <laughs> oh she's killing me anywho so that's gonna be the bag of the week we're going we're going that we're going retro we're going casual we are wearing we're wearing the thing and we'll see how it goes i think i'll be very happy i don't worry about her because she's all stained up if it rains if it's sunny 
it's it is what it is and she lives her life so that is the bag of the week but what goes with the hands for the bag of the week jazz hands jazz hands it is spring it is meh, weather we already had a neutral shade going on do i want to be black and just bitter like my my soul or do i want to do something fun festive gorgeous pink bright pink maybe happy something happy and fun i don't know am i gonna am i in a dark place so we've got shady navy indigo away or royalty blue it's like am i in a dark place or am i bright and cheerful i kind of feel like i'm in a dark place it just seems so much fun shady navy <laughs> in a dark place or we could go a burgundy I don't know. I'm torn. Or I could just go naked. No nails. You know what? How about we go, we go this route. We go sparkly blue. Because I want to be in a dark place. But I want to be happy about it. And be shimmery and sparkly. So we're going that route. We're going that route. All right. We have picked, we have picked the tone. We are going to be giving the cold shoulder. Okay, we're gonna recap the fragrances. So we were going to be spa-like, refreshing, renewed. It's spring. It's all about the new growth. <laughs> what did we do? We pretty much wore Cactus Garden and Wood sage and sea salt pretty much every day. I think I I wore this one one of the days. I ignored this half of the room. Um, yeah, I just like every day woke up and was like, yeah, it's it's a Joe Malone kind of day, and it was yeah, it was good. I I I enjoy it. There's a reason why I bought this um, set for Christmas that's refill. So, you know, it is a really good scent. It is worth having and it keeps me from using up all of my cactus garden. That's for sure. Um, so yeah, that was the intention of the week. So we know this, this was not our friend and that's okay. I love Wonder Woman. The empowerment of it is great. She's going back. Cactus Garden. I just have to baby that because it's my favorite. But we need to give Wood Sage and Sea Salt a break. So we need. You can go back up here and be fabulous with your cohorts up there. How do we want to live this week? How do we want to live? We haven't worn those but then I have to I bought those for the travel and um they're just a pain in the ass to quite honestly to reload so that's why I hardly ever wear those but I should try them again hmm we'll see maybe I think we're gonna go floral we're gonna do city of stars from Louis Vuitton, we're going to go and let's bring up what else? P 
pan oh, we'll do Joe Malone again. Peony and blush suede. Peony and blush suede. We will go. We will go. We're not touching. I don't know. As much as I love these cupcakes, they they're giving me these two, in particular these whispers over here, give me headaches. And I don't know, I need to try them again, but I'm having having issues. Kayali. Love this. That is the Tom Ford burning cherry dupe. What's this one? Eden Juicy Apple. Ooh. That could be fun. Juicy Apple. Or. Oh, wait. Do I have two love this? What? Why did I buy two of those? Oh my God, we've hit, we've hit a problem when I have two. Oh my God, Nancy. Okay, we're wearing, we're wearing Burn and Cherry. We're wearing Apple. Fruity Floral. Okay. One more. Um, good God, really, Nance. And last... What else is a fruity floral that we have that we could do? Those are heavy on the fruits. Wonder what mine would be a fruity floral again. No, spicy. That's raspberry and pepper. That's not fruity floral. Um, one, number six. Yeah, that's a little bit more fruity floral. So let's go, all right. There we go. Here is the tray of the week. We'll see how this week goes. I finished the, there we go. There's a true to color. So that's the frosted metals, cold shoulder. And I really do like the coverage on these you can't really tell when the um, chips start happening until it's like really really far gone but there's two coats